Hello chickadees! My name is Sarah Teelan. Welcome to my new recording area. I it was taking a few couple of days, but um, finally got to move my computer and audio stuff into another room, and I'm very much ha I'm a lot more happier. This sounds a lot better. It feels a lot more uh, condensed. Like it's more into one space and do everything like piling everywhere else or like in different directions. So I have. Um, as you can see, the new foam, and as far as for me recording, like, a few things, the audio sounds a lot more better. Of course, because the last room I recorded it had high ceilings, so my voice was a lot more echoey. And, I, again, I'm very happy how this has turned out so far right now, and as you guys would already know from my Twitter, I put more of my stuff on Twitter, um, from days ago when I posted this, like, you didn't know I was gonna move this guys from on YouTube, but on Twitter, um, I had to move onto a very, really bad, crappy wooden desk. I'll put like a picture like right here. It's um, not that great. It's very small, but it's what I have. But again, I'm very happy knowing that I'm in a better room for recording, even though I have a very small and condensed area than I had a bigger one. But again, I'm very more happy with. The lighting, the sound, and um, the video quality of my camera is a little bit better than I did last time because there was like a part of the webcam where it was lagging and it might have been because of the autofocus on it, either that and the really weird times where the lights would change and I feel like at this point now I could kind of focus on like having the light just stay as one instead of having the the webcam, like, I don't know, it's just so weird. My webcam was doing it, like, for a really rare moment. And I have a 180p Logitech camera. It's, like, one of the few, like, very popular webcams that a lot of people will use as their first webcam, or either 190p. But I wanted to give, like, the best resolution for you guys so you can guys can watch my videos. And, um, some people can even use their camera. And I was even considering that if this camera does it again, I might have to set up everything with an actual camera, which I hope I don't, but it, it does look a lot more better quality, I can see that, but like, it's having to set up everything that I'm very kind of concerned about if at that point where I, if I need to do it, because I have already have, again, a small enough bad wooden desk, and maybe at some point during maybe the years if I earn enough, or if I have as a gift, then I'll definitely get a better desk, because... Um, it's kind of hard not to bump into this because I have this small wall right here and it's kind of hard to move around and you probably hate me having to ramble and explain but again I'm just very much happy to uh, show you guys and hopefully you like it too as a new recording area. I even had a poll on my Twitter whether if you, for some people if you liked foam or clear background and as you probably have guessed I do not have my blue background anymore, and the reason was because when I had my blue background was because one, I really liked it, but two, is because of that big room I used to record in, it had a lot of echo. So when I put that screen in there, it kind of put the reverberations of my voice back to the, the screen behind me, so it kind of sounded more close than far. Either way, I still loved it, but I felt like if I brought it back, it'd be, again, a lot more harder to put in. Plus, not everyone likes to see a solid color background, and about some of the pulp, some people said, yeah, and then some said no. So I just said, you know, I have this really nice desk area I wanted to put around in, um, foam padding, because I wanted to, I, again, I wanted to put more of the sound where it should be, which is foam, and I am very much happier, and especially, like, having to see a white wall, that doesn't look very appealing. White wall. There we go. <laughs> Black wall. There we go. Foaming. And, um, yeah, I'm just really getting a lot more happier with where this is going. Where I'm, at. I'm at six minutes right now. Sorry, I'm wanting to make this a really good long video, so it's not just, um, talking about what I have back here, but also having changes to the channel itself. So, other than now foaming, recording, and new area, um, I'm still considering that when... I twitch, I'm gonna be in the same area. Of course, I'm not gonna switch to any other places, so if you're interested in seeing the twitch, my twitch is down uh, in, in the links below. So I'm still kind of not sure yet when I'm gonna be able to do twitching, but maybe like 
during the evening times again like during the months but maybe again not on schedule this is something i'm still figuring out but i'm very happy with the layout out i did have put onto uh, my twitch channel um, i'm still working up to get another new tablet because all of that art i made was actually by pen and or pencil and pen and as much as I am very happy with it right now, maybe in the future once I get um, a new tablet, I'd make it like it look a lot more spruced up because, again, I don't have one. I had one, but um, it kind of broke on me. It's just, again, I'm very happy with how my Twitch looks right now. And, um, yeah, for a lot of you who probably were asking if whether I have a Facebook or not, I'm not. I've decided right to the point that I'm really not going to have a Facebook because one, if you're really curious, I'm really not much of a Facebook person anyways. And if you just, if you're really interested, again, if you want to see other social media, then I have Instagram, I have tw Twitter, of course, and then I have Tumblr, which I go on Tumblr a lot. So if you like reblogs and some of my occasional artwork, maybe again, hopefully sometime when I get a new tablet, I'd love I'd more than love to do like maybe a piece of artwork maybe once a week or more because I love drawing but um the only type of art I can do currently is traditional art which is like pen and pencil of course and nothing digital which everyone loves digital art and I love it too but sometimes occasionally I like doing traditional art too but again it kind of depends on like what you're kind of doing so if it's stuff like banner art or like stuff that kind of spruces up like a profile page digital art kind of goes out the way but um with the ca with the mic i'm having having the pop filter right here too so it probably sounds a lot more better i would have like it have it like right in front of me my only thing is is that then it's kind of hard for me to have the small space to the keyboard so let me know if like if this sounds good because it does sound good but Sometimes I have to put it off to the side as well, but overall, I'm just very happy again with how things are laid put and maybe in the future things will add on. And then I think that's everything I want to talk about. I mean, if you're wanting and curious, like, what's going on, then please ask me, like, in the comment section or on Twitter. And, um, yeah, I'm really having a really good day today, and I hope you guys have been having a really good day too. I mean, you gotta have a good day, right? Right? Alright, so thank you so much for watching everybody. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya! I didn't want to wear my scarf today. It's just so warm. Still, the heat in California is just really hot. I just wanted to wear it because, like, this is an introduction video. I should actually still, or, like, some kind of vlog video, I should wear my scarf, but, or my bandana, but it's just really warm. I'm glad I have it off now. Whew.